In tonight's Operation Safe Roads report, the Happy Valley Road rush hour bottleneck will hopefully be a thing of the past, but not right away. Yeah, we're just getting started on the project to remove the roundabouts above I-17 and reconstruct two interchanges in North Phoenix. ABC 15's Angie Cayley explains when drivers can expect lane closures. Work is now getting started to replace these roundabouts on Happy Valley Road near I-17. For the next nearly two years, drivers in this area can expect to see lane restrictions and a lot of changes. If you're not used to driving in a roundabout, they can be confusing. At 5 o'clock, it's a madhouse. Bob Anderson is talking about the roundabout on Happy Valley Road over I-17. The people that come into roundabouts, if they don't know the right of way, you have got an accident, and a lot of them are in a hurry. The two roundabouts on Happy Valley Road and the interchange at Pinnacle Peak Road are going to be replaced with a diamond interchange, which includes wider bridges, traffic lights, and three lanes. Doug Ninsel, spokesperson for ADOT, says the reconstruction has nothing to do with the popularity of this circular design. It's really because the growth in this area of North Phoenix has exploded. The roundabouts are a good option, especially in certain areas. In this particular case, traffic growth doesn't support the roundabouts anymore. Starting Saturday night until Wednesday morning, expect lane restrictions in the overnight hours while crews erect barrier walls. Then beginning Sunday night, about a mile stretch of the HOV lane near the Happy Valley Road exit will be closed for close to a year. Drivers are going to need to know that they should merge out of that carpool lane approaching the Happy Valley Road area. Anderson looks forward to the day he can leave the shopping center at rush hour and not have to jockey for a spot on the road. Are you glad they're taking them out? Yes, I am, because at 5 o'clock, again, if you try and get out of here, it's going to take, it's a madhouse, and people do not give the right away. They're just not fair, and they just, it's crazy. When the project is done, this bridge that causes so much backup will be demolished. The project is expected to last until the fall of 2020. In North Phoenix, Angie Cayley, ABC 15, Arizona. Some